Today I'll be showcasing to you guys a very good plugin for any SMPs, especially if you're creating an Earth SMP. It's called Dynamap and it can basically project your entire world onto a website where you can view where every one of your players are. The first step is obviously going to be downloading the plugin, so go download the plugin in the description of this video along with my Twitch link, because why not just follow me on Twitch, it'll be just nice. So after you did that, you just put the jar file into your plugins folder and after you did that, restart your server and then you should have this, configuration.txt. First thing you got to do after you open this up is change this right here to vlowres or low res, but I recommend you do low res. Basically, this will make the resolution of your map smaller so it will not crash your website when you're trying to do it. The next thing you got to do is change the image format. To search this up, just click Ctrl F and search up image dash format exactly like that you should find this if it's not jpeg you change the jpeg the next thing you got to do is just save this now just simply head to your server console and then type in after you have restarted your server type in ein map full render and then world name for my world name it's just world but it depends on your server enter and it should just start doing it. And after that is finished, head back to your configuration.txt. Then now you're gonna look for port right here. You're gonna change the port to any number that is larger than 1024. So I just chose a random number. You can actually literally do anything for this and then click save. And after you did that, basically just go to Chrome and then type out your server's IP address into the Google tab along with the port you put in, any number above 1024 that you put in and saved, and then click enter. And your world should have been loaded fully. Thank you for watching my video. I know I haven't been active on YouTube that much recently, but I'm thinking of going back to creating more tutorial videos for plugins. So if you guys like it, just like the video. I'll just know that you guys enjoyed the video or found it helpful. And be sure to follow me on Twitch. I'm going to be streaming daily from there. So yeah, just try to make, try to get me to like 200 followers at least. Let's try that.